if I have any subscribers, I'll say hello. Probably have two. I'm not gonna turn it onto my face because I look like a mess. But we're gonna look at beautiful Bunali because like they're gorgeous and majestic and magical. Like look at those eyes. They read into your soul saying, love me, take care of me. Also, budgie fluffs, all oh, budgie fluffs. Uh, we also have Odd with us, someone I had thanked in my MF video, as long along with for the trip, sadly. But I brought Benali along because I figured uh, it'd be cool to have my persona go out other than random conventions. Oh. Excuse me. So, if you guys ever have any questions or anything, post them below. Like, if you have questions about Bunali as, like, what are they, or what's their backstory, or whatever, feel free to leave those messages below. And I have to say, I'm super excited. How about you? Are you excited for this trip, Art? Oh, yeah. I love to go bowling and meet new people. It's always a good thing. Awesome sauce. So... I wanted to discuss my last video because <laughs> there wasn't actually any video feed compared to my past videos. And the, the, the reason for it was I did not think ahead when I was... You remember that? Like, tell them how bad my phone was. The part where it locked up constantly or the part where you never got my messages until like half an hour later? Not recent, jeez. Oh, what was it called? You never that, fucking answered me because there wasn't any messages on your phone. That, okay, so what Arthur's explained that happened a little bit after what happened at Con is I was really bad at responding because I was out be, being Bunali and socializing. So you put things in your pocket. In your I put pouch. them in my bag. I didn't even watch around. I like wore my bag. Cause like I'm a bird, I, I don't have a, I don't have a pouch. You have a fanny pack that you took with you. Bunali is equipped with a a pouch. Is not marsupial. The point is not it, a koala. Not a koala. Definitely not a kangaroo. It would be cool to be a kangaroo, but like that long tail life. I could not handle this, the, the cleaning alone. Like, I have to spot treat just Bunali's cheek fluffs and eyebrows all the fucking time. And that's just not... It's just not... Ugh, can't do it. So, I have to say I'm super excited because this will be like the first time Bunali's kind of went out as this uh, stage of the head. If you've seen my previous, like, my previous videos, especially uh, my channel video, You'll notice that, like, the beak is totally different now. Like, this one can open. Open. Close. Open. Close. I will say, MFF, I had a lot of comments saying that, uh, are you an owl bear? And, I, I mean, look at these ears. Do these read owl bear to you? I'm pretty sure they're bunny ears. Um, problem, though. Like, I'm, I'm so used to people thinking an owl. Someone said I was an eagle. I was a Furby a lot. Shut up, we don't talk about the Furby. Okay, so, uh, I'm gonna post a, a picture later of what my friend means by Furby. Because apparently, apparently Bunali looks like a Furby. I mean, it, but that's only because... I know what Bunali is and comfortable in the fact that they're a bunna bird. But like man, I I didn't do too bad a job on those follow me eyes. That that that's that's like satisfying to watch. So there will be some updates to Bunali in the future. I'm planning on making their cheeks less floaty. Maybe I don't know. I I'm nervous to take Bunali's head apart to make again. Because, like, after working on so many times, you kind of just don't want to keep redoing the same head. So, what I'll probably do is, like, 
just go into the eyes and like gently uh, clean them clean the paint out because I did not seal my paint which is probably for the best because I decided to change their eye color I, I thought I liked it at first being blue but now I realize that green is more uh, Bunali speed and that means these nice vibrant blues will become a vibrant green to match their uh, magic palette because if you guys don't know about Bunali Bunali is a uh, is a magical creation by there's like a long backstory that the, the T TLDR of it is they're magic because they were uh, all right everybody <laughs> apparently my phone was crapping out on me again uh, you got to see a peek of my hair so that's cool I mean if you guys have watched my last updated video that I did probably only a couple days ago for MFF you'll know what I look like, but like, I don't like talking on camera. I know, I know that sounds really weird, but like, maybe it's because of my prior experience with YouTube. kind of cringe away from being on camera directly, and I show you the furry goodness that you'd rather see, which is Bunali. I mean, I'll show, I'll show my friends. My friends are chill, but like, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna put you through seeing my my dopey face. Fam, you know we love you and that dopey face. I, I understand that, but it doesn't mean that I like my dopey face. I mean, you don't have to. You I'm have I'm to just like not my face. type. I'm just not my own type and that's fine. I am my type. What are you talking about? I am <laughs> I love myself. And that's a good thing. That's something you can handle, but like we all know that this bird, this bird here has crippling depression and not even a joke. Like, I take my medication, or at least I try to. Man, traffic's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Like, I was worried it was gonna be a lot busier than this. Ah, oh, no, you made me, no. Rotating video. Okay. Oh, jeez. Anyway, man. Phone down. Uh, on I-70, you're good. Now, when we go home, it's going to be a little busier because everybody's going home. Dude, you're on the rumble strip. Uh -huh. You just were. I was. <laughs> I got off of it before you said I was. <laughs> <laughs> dog's crazy. He's thinking parakeet. <laughs> But yeah, uh, you'll notice that instead of saying parakeet, a lot of times I will say budgie. I found the word cuter, and it was like how I was interested to the bird in general. Is uh, I read this uh, Webtoons comic called uh, Crap, now I don't remember what it's called. That's not good. Uh, I think the writer's name is Muffin. Their life with their budgies and it's really good call half of their character names like there's Tony and Chewy and Nari and Sophie and uh, I can't remember what the parallel's called I remember Soba I just don't remember what the green ones are. I'd probably get like destroyed for that um really researching hardcore into budgies and then I got two budgies which are Aster and Thistle they're the so-called roommates I mentioned in my channel video so yeah look at all that road and we still have over an hour yeah we have it's like I don't even know where navigation says we are I can't even can I check it while I'm in stream yes I can and we're back! Reunited and it feels so good! Hey, Reunited because we understood! What? That's the song! I know. Well, you know. I'm filming the driver, obviously. I'm showing that I'm being a responsible YouTuber and not actually driving while streaming. No offense streamers to that i just one i don't drive like at all 
tech and dangerous and I don't wish the death upon me. Jeez, you would think it's illegal. I guess it is. I don't know how many other YouTube but if you're from Indiana, comment below. I'd greatly appreciate it. It's illegal. It's a reckless driving offense, dude. It's really dangerous. Reckless driving offense? Seriously? Yeah. That's so it's considered weird. reckless driving because you're distracted while you're driving on the road. That's so weird. But it's just like, I've seen other tubers, and I'm not going to like name names because, like, what's the point? You probably already know them. If you follow any furry YouTube, you know who they are. And there's nothing wrong with... There, to me, there is nothing wrong with driving and doing a live because it's a good way to communicate with your kids, your fans. But, like, if you're actually going to stream and drive, at least have it on its own dock and don't be touching it too often and don't be, like, checking chat every so often. Just, just be careful. Because, like... You never know what the road's gonna do. Like, oh my gosh, help MFF. Yeah, go for it. All right, so story time. At MFF, Art, myself, and my son, who we're gonna call, uh, sh uh, is it Xion or, or is it Zan? Zan. Zan. Anyways, we, we were driving to the Walmart, but like, if you don't know how certain Walmarts are, you'll realize that like, some of them have wood forest banks and some of them do not. And sadly, the closest one to us did not have a wood forest bank and Art had to go to the bank for drawing out that good moolah for a uh, convention. Yeah, we should probably have done it before we left, but like, we wanted to make sure we got up to our motel in time. Plus, I didn't get paid until we were already up there. Y you know what moolah I'm talking about. I'm not talking about your paycheck. Oh, yeah. No, I know that. We're talking about your good moolah. The, the savings moolah. Anyway. But, like... <sighs> I am so dizzy right now. I don't so, we were driving down the road. Yeah, we were driving down... We were driving down the road. And... We were being careful drivers, like, I wasn't talking with, like, just being, I wasn't being a distraction as the passenger, I was navigating, and my son was in the back, and Art, Art was driving, we were in this car when it happened, and some person was on their phone, and they decided to merge on our side without, like, so much as a warning, like, no. they were behind us, no, but then they man. had speed up. No. What? They didn't murder they weren't paying attention and got too close to me and sideswiped me. I know, I was getting ready to explain that. I'm just explaining it might have been a merge, but we don't know. Either way it goes, like, I was, like, at the door. Like, it was this side. It scared the shit out of me. But, like, it probably scared Art more because they're driving, and that's terrifying. Yeah, I mean, when a big-ass truck hits you, what are you going to do? Yeah, and it's, like... The only plus side I could say from us getting hit was that it didn't take out Art's uh, mirror. As you can see, it's still plainly intact. Yeah, only because it's movable. Yeah, but like the way in which this dude collided with us, it, he he must have like drove far ahead and wasn't paying attention and like drifted. Like he was like over there and he was far ahead and then he drifted and pu pushed back hit us to where the folding mechanism right there push the mirror in. There's, there's some decent scrapes though from it. But like, other than that, we, we're all good. I think my brain's kind of lightly panicking from the last time, but we'll be good. I'll take my bed and we'll be good. But, yeah. If you guys haven't noticed, art has finally started to show true color. Because, uh, the hair, look at it. It's so cool persona color now. It's great. Fuck me. I, got to, I didn't, I just wanted to dye my hair. It just happened to go this way and I love it. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm not judging you. My dude, I dyed your hair. Of course I'm not judging you. Also, yes. Yes. Those nails glow in the dark, by the way. Crayola has this, like, really bomb-ass uh, nail polish that 
It's uh, scented and it glows in the dark. It's a blueberry flavor. Yeah, and it's just like, to everyone else, this probably appears more greenish because the filtering shows it very yellowed in here. Like, even looking at Boonie's fur, it looks more, like, yellowed than it is. It has the lighting in this car. Yeah, you're right, you're right. But, like, those though. Yes. So, I think I'm going to stop this live for right now so I can, like, relax. We left really.